Hello everyone. I am Krishnan. I am a project titled on a uh, study on fluid dynamics of UASB reactor for biogas production. And I was guided by Ms. Dr. A. P. Shanmugam, principal scientist of CSCR CLRI, and Mr. A. Pradeep Kumar, assistant professor of uh, Vail Tech Engineering College. My uh, abstract is my abstract is to treat the uh, effic uh, treatment of industrial effluent efficiently where uh, the, pro uh, the effluent is a serious problem faced on a uh, few past few decades and we uh, i'm using usb reactor which is a lab scale uh, reactor by using peristaltic pump for uh, injecting the sub effluent from the bottom we since USB uh, reactor has more uh, advantages over conventional uh, anaerobic sludge blanket reactor, I have chosen a USB reactor. The main aim of the project is to st uh, study the daily production of biogas using RO reject from tanneries and to find the resident time distribution of the reactor for various air flow rates. RTD is done, uh, is done to know the fate of the pollutants inside the reactor. All the analyses are done as per American standard have uh, association guidelines rtd were conducted by means of trace analysis and results were predicted based on mixing efficiency and dispersion number uasb reactor that is upflow anaerobic sludge blanket reactor type of fluid which is the rheology neutrin or non neutrin present time distribution analysis and dispersion numbers are the keywords of the uh, project Water is one of the most, as we know, water is the most valuable natural resources on earth without which the survival of plant could be possible. Water pollution has been becoming a major problem in this past few decades and National Security Council surveys that about 10,000 million liters per day of toxic waste are generated by tanneries, pharmaceuticals pesticides, dye and various other industries. The small scale, small scale industries generate about 5,217 million liters of waste per day. Wastewater is a combination of water and waste, a water carrying waste originating from household, commercials, and industrial amenities and the institutions. However, untreated wastewater generally contains high levels of organic materials, numerous pathogenic microorganisms, nutrients, and uh, toxic compounds leading to environment problems, pollutions, and hazards. The focus of the wastewater is broadening from public health protection and effluent quality to concept driven by sustainability. The main aim of the study is to treat the effluent coming out from tanning industries around Kanpur by means of ESB process. Leather industries, as we there are four different types of process involved in the process of leather industries that are preparation for tanning, actual tanning and other chemical treatment, retaining that is to provide strength and finishing. Upflow anaerobic sludge blanket reactor. What the UASB reactor is a methogenic digester that in evolved from anaerobic clary digester. A similar but varying technology to USB is expanded granular sludge blanket digester. USB uses anaerobic process while forming a blanket of granular sludge which suspended in the tank. Wastewater flows upwards through the blanket and it is processed by anaerobic microorganisms. The upward flow combined with the settling action of gravity suspends to the, the blanket with aid of three months. Small such granules begin to form whole uh, whose surface area is covered in agitation aggregation of to a bacteria. In the absence of any support matrix, the flow conditions create selective environment in only those microorganisms capable to attach survive and profile rate. Advantages of USB reactor as as USB have high reduction of uh, biological oxygen demand and can withstand high organic and hydraulic loading rates, low sludge productions, low sludge productions, no aeration system is required in a uh, USB reactor, effluent is rich in nutrients and can be used for agricultural irrigations and land demand is less. The principle of uh, upflow anaerobic sludge market reactor is RO reject wastewater flows in the bottom of the anaerobic flow tank by means of uh, 
peristaltic pump the accumulated sludge forms granules microorganism lives in the degrade the organic pollutants by anaerobic digestion the uh, sludge is kept in the suspension by flow regime and formed gas bubbles the separator at the top of the reactor allows to convert biogas for energy production nutrients effluents for agriculture to retain the sludge in the reactor components any type of material which are watertight material rectangular or in circular forms can be used for con uh, constructing usb reactor the critical element for the biogas uh, for the usb reactor are the effluent distribution system the gas solid separation and effluent withdrawal disease a design this is the basic geometry of a usb reactor where there are the label uh, the, they are labeled into different phases the guiding parameters for the performance of usb reactor are geological parameters physical parameters chemical parameters environmental para uh, para factors and other factors which consist of type of fluid viscosity of fluid shear stress flow type influence of variation oxygen transfer rate color odor temperature solids and the chemical characteristics such as chloride uh, alkalinity as acidity hydrogen concentration bod cod vfa that is volatile fatty acids and uh, environment factors such as ph alkalinity volatile acid concentration temperature and toxic materials and other factors that are food bacteria contact and hrt that is hydraulic retention time resident time resident time distribution analysis is carried down to verify the performance of the uh, reactor and this is used to know the fate of the reactor and it can also determine any malfunction in the reactor and this is done by using a tracer element called rhodamine b when when found to be uh, this usb reactor is found to be completely mixed flow reactor that is cstr the rtd shows how long the pollutant can stay inside the reactor the objective of the study is to recover bio energy potential as biogas optimization or reject and treat plant sludge mixing ratio to enrich uh, biogas production optimizing the flow rate of to feed to achieve optimum influent uh, distribution gas separation and effluent withdrawal and to find resident time distribution of the reactor need for the study is to implement waste to energy system that has potential to make the industry self sufficient in terms of thermal energy requirements and efficient management of ro reject and treatment plant sludge rtd is an eff efficient tool to diagnose any malfunctions in the reactor the scope of the study is, is to the biogas can be used for production of electricity and heat as as a natural gas and substitute and also transportation fuel and combined heat and power plant system not only generates power but also produces heat in house requirement and main maintain to uh, level in digester during cold season by adopting psb pcb norms that is pollution control board norms zero effluent discharge can be effectively achieved and conversion of organic into inorganic compounds can be achieved these are the literature reviews which are collected where maximum removal rate of propionic acids as a soil of carbon source in usb reactor all uh, increases the amount of biogas produced and anaerobic treatment of pulp and paper uh, mill are uh, achieved uh, and effective removal of volatile fatty acid concentration can yield more amount of methogenic matho bacteria which will increase the efficiency of biogas methogenic acid and ph conditions in the semi continuous reactor systems can be achieved for um, efficient lower the ph and efficient control production of biogas these are the methodology sample collection parameter analysis rtd rhodamine b standardization optimization of sample and activated sludge mixture pulse method to uh, estimate rtd stack method and design of uh, the reactor and biogas collection setting up the reactor can be done using the volume of the reactor and an amount of uh, inflow in the reactor this is the lab scale uh, biogas production this is the autocad diagram this is schematic diagram 
RTD is done by using uh, tracer analysis which uses rhodamine B injecting at a uh, spontaneous point will induces what type of reactor is found. Results RTD is found to be CSTR and this is the calibration of UA, uh, rhodamine B and its impact curve determined by mean residence time under 110 ml per liter and in the 50 percent of mixing is found out at 80 minutes and the condition is found out to be CSTR and this can be checked using dispersion number that is 0.0218 it is found to be CSTR so this is the different stages in mixing these are the tests for conducted for uh, efficient biogas production, volatile fatty acids, ammonia, alkalinity, chemical oxygen demand, and biogas found, uh, production. The biogas composition in, uh, is found out to be methane is uh, found out to be 60 to 75 percent, CO2 is 90 to 33, and nitrogen is 1 percent, and other gases in this rate. Conclusion it, it is found to be CSTR. Uh, the RO reject is uh, maintained constant shear stress in the surface of the reactor avoids frequent K clear as COD increases volatile count also increased and it was 60 to 70 percent was found out these are the references which was collected